Welcome to another episode of the North Chuck Hookup, the one show that gives you the best of Charleston and Charleston living. I'm Alicia Brown, buyer specialist with the Chapman Group at Carolina Elite Real Estate. And today you're hanging out around town with Alicia Brown. So today we're visiting one of my favorite preserves, Cypress Garden. Cypress Garden has been open to the public since the 1960s. It's been the backdrop of few movies like The Notebook, but it's near and dear to me because this is the location my husband and I took our engagement photos. I know you're gonna love it as much as I do, so let's take a tour. So today we're here with Heather, the director of Cypress Garden. She's going to tell us a little bit more about the place. But first, Heather, thanks a lot for having us. Um, so Cypress Garden. Yes, thank you for coming. Um, we love getting all of our information out there so we can get more visitors. Um, so Berkeley County has owned Cypress Garden since 1996. Um, it's a 175 acre park. We have a um, blackwater swamp that you can take flat bottom boats out on. Um, we have four and a half miles of walking trails. We have an aquarium. We call it a swamparium. Um, don't like the word up because you won't find it. Um, we have a butterfly house that's open year round. We have bird aviaries. Um, we have playground equipment, picnic shelters, and a lot of areas that you can rent um, if you want to have a wedding or a reception or birthday parties, that kind of stuff. Um, and we're getting ready to open our Heritage Museum that was closed after the flood. Um, that will be the last building that we have that will need to be completely redone since the flood. Mm -hmm. um, but we just have a beautiful, beautiful place out here. It is beautiful. So I know that you guys were shut down for four years after that flood. What are some of the updates you've done? Well, we expanded our playground. So before we had like two little pieces of playground equipment. Now we have some huge equipment and also um, some equipment that is handicap accessible. Um, so we did that and we redid our Dean Hall, which is absolutely gorgeous. Um, that's a rental facility. And then we changed the front lawn. You'll see that it's big and open now. It doesn't have a walking path going through it. And our boat dock is completely different than what it was beforehand. Um, it's absolutely gorgeous, has wood. I mean, it's just, it's just, it's just beautiful. It's a floating boat dock. Um, so, I mean, pretty much everywhere in here, we touched and changed it a little bit. So one of the visitors' most favorite attractions are the birds. Can you tell us a little bit more about them? Yes, um, all these birds were um, donated to us. And the one that will talk to you the most is Triton. And it's the white one over there. He's a cockatoo. Um, normally he'll sing or he'll yell at you or um, say good morning or pretty bird. Um, Zeus right here, he is actually a peg-like bird. Um, he ended up having an accident and so he only has one leg, but you would never know it. He adjusted very quickly. Um, but they all love to see the visitors and they copy everybody. So like when kids are here, if they start screaming, the birds start screaming. And so you have to listen to it the entire day. Ah, I mean, it's just horrible. Um, so we always try to run out here and say, pretty bird, pretty bird, to get them to say something else. Oh, yeah. um, but they love to entertain. When we were closed, they were so sad because nobody was here. Um, but now that we open back up, they're absolutely loving it. And all the love. Yeah. So I see my favorite attraction over here, um, the Butterfly House. Let's um, take a peek. So my favorite is the Butterfly House. How many butterflies do you hold here? Oh goodness. Um, a lot of times we'll have over 250. Um, we do um, purchase our butterflies and so they come in frozen. Um, actually they're frozen when they're put on the truck and then by the time they get here they're thawed out and you open up the, the envelope and they just come flying out. Um, so we do try to keep it stocked with butterflies. Um, we always have them year round. And um, yeah, they, you can just come in and, you know, depending on which ones we get, some of them are very friendly and always want to land on you. Well, that's awesome. I didn't even know you could freeze butterflies. What adventures are we in for today? If you like nature and alligators, come along.
fall in my oh god So if you love beauty and nature, make sure you check out Cypress Garden. I can't wait to hear about your visit. You could get more info at cypressgarden.berkeleycountysc.gov. Thanks for watching another episode of the North Chuck Hookup, the one show that brings you the best of Charleston. Make sure you subscribe to our channel. And if you have questions about real estate or what it's like to live here, you can check out my contact information below. Thank you.